Hi and welcome to this video in which I'm going to show you how to run the Fisher Global Significance Test uh, in EVU. So in linear regression, uh, the problem of uh, global significance of uh, uh, regression is very important in order to see uh, if uh, we can uh, assume that there exists at least one coefficient that is uh, different from zero. So uh, maybe a student test, a student coefficient test in uh, linear regression and p-values can uh, determine if one or not a coefficient is statistically significant or different to zero. zero. But uh, global significant test uh, try to uh, to analyze globally uh, if whether or not uh, we can suppose that uh, uh, our model is uh, globally significant. So uh, if the first time you are watching one of my videos, do not hesitate to subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking on the red button at the uh, right uh, of, the, of your screen and don't uh, forget to uh, activate the notification bell and like uh, my video because you will help me uh, understand that uh, the effort that I'm making have uh, very well touched what, uh, one of my targets. So uh, coming back into uh, global significant test in uh, EVU to run the global significant test in EVUs, you need to go in your equation tab and to go to view. When you are in view, go to coefficient diagnostic and select uh, world coefficient restriction. So in world coefficient restriction, we have our coefficient. If you must know the first coefficient is made as C1, the second as C2, C3, C4, C5, and C6. So we are going to test if one or not uh, the uh, coefficient of different variable are uh, jointly equal to zero or at least one of coefficient is different to zero. So our null hypothesis is that C2 equal uh, C3 uh, equal uh, C4 equal C uh, to uh, C5 equal to C6 so uh, C2 because uh, the second coefficient that have been estimated is the coefficient of the first variable uh, C3 is the coefficient of the second variable and C5 is the coefficient of the third variable And so on. So uh, equal to zero. So we are going to test the null hypothesis of C zero, C two equal C three equal C four equal uh, C five equal C uh, six equal zero uh, against the alternative that uh, there exists at least one of coefficient that is uh, different to zero. So then we click on OK that the result of our test have been uh, higher have a p value of Fisher statistic more than uh, less than 0.5%, almost zero, meaning that we reject the null hypothesis that uh, all our coefficients are equal to zero, meaning that we can suppose that there exists at least one coefficient that. Different to zero. So that's it for this Fisher uh, uh, Global Significant Test in EVUs. And if you have just uh, not yet subscribed to my YouTube channel, do it uh, and don't forget to uh, activate the notification bell and like the video. It will be a pleasure to you to come back to.